Hello, if you're an OG Mudkip fan, you probably remember his mildly interesting facts series. He's not going to continue it, which I was sad about because I really loved that series. So I'm doing it myself. Here are 10 mildly interesting facts about the world of RuneScape you probably didn't know before. Number one is that you can give a monkey talisman back to the monkey child, and he'll give you a hug. I thought this was really sweet and had to include it. Number two is that Solra is the gender fluid icon we didn't know we needed. The High Priestess refers to Solra as male, but the examine text in the boss lair display calls Zolra a female. You may think this means we just don't know Zolra's gender, but I like to think it means Zolra literally changes gender. Like Zolra changes their scales, why not their gender too? That sounds way more fun. If you speak to a private in Barbarian Assault, they'll make you exercise. Just like in the Drill Demon random event, except with the private you do the emotes automatically. You can buy an undead chicken during or after animal magnetism. It's considered a fun weapon, meaning it has negative stats. The animation in combat is really funny. If you put a fishbowl in a pet arena, it sort of talks. Number 6 is crop circles. I actually stumbled upon a crop circle once by accident in Yanil, otherwise I probably wouldn't have known they existed until now. You can use them to get to Piro Piro. And using one allows you to go through wheat faster. When you want to leave Piro Piro, the portal takes you back to the field you were in before. I mostly just love the animation. Looks like the crop circle is gone. If you want to find one yourself, just go to a wheat field and hop worlds until you see one. The Slayer Tower basement is dimly lit, though a light source isn't required down here. You can bring one to make the area a bit brighter. Or at least that's what it says on the wiki. Maybe it only works for certain light sources or the difference is too subtle, but I'm not sure I noticed a change. Feel free to try it out yourself though. And while I'm at the Slayer Tower basement, searching these chests can randomly give you a strange message. For a moment you think you've found Zamrak's teddy bear, but the chest is empty. This is a reference to Pontac from the Frimnik Trials. During the quest, he asks you to bring him a list of unobtainable items for his vote. One of them is Zamorak's teddy bear. There are two jungle flowers here by Uzer. They're only found in the jungle, so how did they get here? Maybe this place used to be a jungle? Number 10, and my personal favorite, you can pet the cows in Sophonim. Sadly, there is no animation for petting the cow, but you comfort the cows and they moo at you. Hopefully when Raid 3 comes out, the cows will be cured. I like the option to pet them to stay, though. Well, I hope you enjoyed these 10 facts. I hope your interest is mildly piqued. 
Or at some point during this video, you said to yourself, Huh, I didn't know that. Thanks for watching. Remember to eat your greens and examine everything. You never know what you'll find. Goodbye, lovelies.